You know, we always talk about this, but comedians are always in danger stepping in it at some point. And right now, Kathy Griffith is knee deep in it right now. She's sparked outrage over her gruesome photo shoot, holding a replica of the severed head of the current White House resident. And she <laughs> quickly posted this apology. Take a look. Yeah. I sincerely apologize. I am just now seeing the reaction of these images. I'm a comic. I crossed the line. I moved the line. Then I crossed it. I went way too far. The image is too disturbing. I understand how it offends people. It wasn't funny. I get it. And sponsors have dropped her. People are calling for her to get fired, thrown in jail, and the Secret Service says they're looking into this. Mm -hmm. um, when you saw it, what was your response? I thought it was bad. I thought it was yeah. awful. I, it, it wasn't funny. Um, like him or not, you know, when you can debate his policy, he's the president. And when I saw that, all I thought of was his kid. He yeah. has an 11 or a 12 year old. And I thought of that child seeing that image and said, you know what? Just because you can say something doesn't mean you should. Or just because you can do something doesn't mean you should. And it bothered me. And I remember um, Ted Nugent had gotten a lot of heat. Mm -hmm. uh, he had said back in 2012, if Barack Obama becomes the next president in November, again, I will either be dead or in jail by this time next year. And when I heard that, I was equally well, he sick to get, get heat because this president invited service, him to the White but House. But the That's Secret Service pictures. went That's and not. checked him out. The Secret Service did their job. And I get it because this is, like him or not, these uh, you can't do this stuff with a sitting president. And you shouldn't. I mean, it's not just a president. It. He's a human. I think the point is that's an image that doesn't make anyone sit comfortably. Yeah. And the fact that it's a reference to beheading, considering the times we've been in and what that symbolizes in our country, mm -hmm. how we've dealt with that blow, that image specifically gives people a visceral reaction. So yeah. there, it, it takes you out. And it, it, was, it, it was crazy. I mean, I was emailing Whoopi most of the night because I was thinking, is this some kind of weird performance art thing that I just don't get? I'm so offended by it. It's, it's so vile and foul. Maybe it's funny and I just don't get it. And, and what, did you, what did I write you back? You said, yeah. it's just not funny. Well, that's it's the not problem. funny. We it's not, not funny. funny. That is and basically the problem. And I mean, look, you know, Chelsea Clinton said a great thing. She said, you know, you should never talk about assassinating a, a, president. a president. You just don't do that. What and, you know, everybody, everybody, you know, as comes, we sometimes go across the line. And she just, she made a mistake. You know, you don't want to bring up. Uh, beheading, you know, thinking of Daniel Pearl. You don't want it, you know, and we've just had all of this violence happen in the last couple of days. And so it was just, it was just, well, you know. there's two things. I mean, if you, we could discuss and argue whether the joke is funny, but I don't see an actual joke. No, there is That's no joke. That's why I thought it was yeah. 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 And I didn't get it. Kathy yeah. even admitted that it That's wasn't not funny. funny. It's no. not funny. But, you know, um, uh, Trump insinuated violence against Hillary at a rally one time, if you recall. Mm -hmm. He said, if she gets to pick her judges, nothing you can do. Although the Second Amendment people, maybe there is, I don't know, ha, 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 implying yeah. that, you know, someone will shoot Hillary. And so when you talk about the children being upset, well, Chelsea Clinton, who's coming on the show today, mm -hmm. uh, that was a little scary for her, I too. Think it's just yeah. isn't funny. So, it's you know, it's, it's, it's and, and I think the, that the fact right that, that, that uh, Kathy is well known, yeah. people are probably putting images like this all over the place. They, mm -hmm. they hang you in effigy, but because she's famous, it will hang around for a while. But I, I don't think, think it's I don't think it's helping her career in but the that's least. That's the question. Like, we've had this she loss might, uh, of civility she, in she, our. You know what? Our she, look, she thought she had. Uh, the audience for it. And what you discovered is it's not there. No right. one wants to see this. You can be as mad at him as you want to. You can say stuff about him. You can do all kinds of stuff. Nobody wants to see this. It wasn't funny. It didn't work. And she's going to now deal with the consequences. But is it career ending? I mean, that was my I question last I, I, night. I don't know <coughs> what ends a career anymore. I've had so many. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. People have, though, and I've said this before here, when on a campus uh, someone says something and they're like, he needs to be fired, everyone jumps straight to that. I also think, I remember a really smart therapist I went to who said, when your reaction is out of proportion to the circumstances of the moment, mm -hmm. it says more about you than them. Yeah. So the idea that people would spend their days down with Kathy Griffin, we have bigger things in our lives. Yeah. People spoke up, mm -hmm. she reacted, now let's move on. Well, yeah. but Pete, Billy Bush lost his... Yeah, but, you know, I, I, again, we've had this loss of civility, and I think that's why people are even more outraged, because it's like enough is enough. Pro 
perhaps starting with Ted Nugent and yeah. and this president they because they yeah, they have terrible. they have um, you know been so aggressive in this way. But we have Billy Bush that that lost his career. We've have ca have had countless numbers of comedians that have lost their That's careers. Right. Is it time for us as a society to say, listen? Enough is enough, well, and you, she you made a, she made a bad artistic choice. He was busted on a video that people can't unsee. It's a character revealer. To me, she's an artist that said, I made a bad choice. He wasn't making a choice. He was over. But, you know, this morning, like, Chris, uh, I'm sorry, did you know? No, 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 that was it. It was just, it tells yeah. you what something about, about Paula Dean? What about Godfrey? Well, what about all these people? Lot, Paula Dean. They did. They yes. did. Chris Cuomo this morning made a statement that I have to take issue with Chris because I love him and he's mm -hmm. been doing a great job. But he said the comedians today are sort of getting mean spirited and going over the line. I, don't, I think he's referring to Saturday Night Live. But I don't mm. really agree with that. I think that the mean spiritedness comes out of the White House and then pe the comedians just respond to it and people are angry and people feel powerless in this country. Right now, he's about to uh, go against the Paris Accords, which, which will in increase climate change uh, negatively. And he's about to do something else stupid like that again, um, uh, putting a, uh, himself with Nicaragua and Syria, the only other two countries in the United Nations who are not going to sign the Paris Accord. Even North Korea is on board for the Paris Accord, and this guy is not going to be on it. So we are furious, and the way that we comedians deal with their anger is to be funny she, or to go yeah, out there. The okay, is a different she that's about the well, That was my yeah. first. She about about beheading of well, a think, president. I think, right, I'm, not, I'm not defending no, that. I think Joy's right. I'm I think not what, defending I think, that. I mean, yeah. what I'm hearing you say is that you know, I think I think the mistake is to group all comedians together. I think you're right. I think a lot of comedians. I go to a lot of comedians and go to a lot of comedy for relief from what's going on because it's scary and it's troubling it's and you're frustrated. It's not just relief, it's retaliation right. and for I, what's going I on. I think that's true for a lot of comedians. I don't think that this fits that bill, and I know you, you don't love this either. Right, but neither I, does I she. Think, yeah, and, but I, I do Her hear what you're saying about enough? accountability, but no, what let would the you have for decide, though. Wait, Wait a minute. It, decide. You know, like, here's, here's let, the thing. Let them decide. We have all stepped in it, and yeah, if you have I've never stepped in it... I have. Okay. So And so, well... Absolutely. If you, okay. Absolutely. So what you do is you learn from the consequences of stepping in it. Yeah. Yeah. She said, I get it. I saw right. it. Because she wasn't yeah. seeing it. You know, sometimes yeah. you do stuff and you don't see what other people see. You see what you think is going to be your big thing. Or your thing. intention or something. And, and, and suddenly yeah. you discover that people say, sorry, this does not work. She kind of knew it, terrible, though. It's a terrible thing. She it's crappy. She kind of knew it, though. I don't know that she kind of knew it. Yeah, she did. Because there was another all video. I, all I can say is how I feel. Feel. Yeah, yeah. Okay? Yeah. And what I feel is she made a mistake and she's paying the, the consequence. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And she's not, you know, going on and on about how you should, you know, berate her and beat her and do yeah. it. That, that's, not gonna, that's not going to fix it. She already knows she's in duty. Yeah. Believe yeah. me, she knows. <laughs> yeah. She appeared in that video. Somebody said, you get on there right now. No yeah. makeup. Yeah, that's true. No makeup. No makeup. Go, yeah. Get no off the kid. toilet and get in that video yeah. and tell people yeah. because you made a mistake. Yeah. And we're all telling you. And just before we go, there was someone, you know, this is not a left or right issue. No, that's right. This is an issue of what is viable for us as a nation and what is not. So all the right side people, stop lumping all the left in. This is not a left or right. This is just a, a stupid bad mistake mm -hmm. one person made. Y'all have made them. We have made them. We're moving on. We'll be right back. Okay. <laughs>